So good morning, good afternoon, uh, good evening, wherever you are in the world. Uh, today, I'm joined again with the very lovely Tanya McCready. Tanya McCready, together with her husband, Hank De Bruin, are the co-owners and the co-founders of Winter Dance Dog Sled Tours. And today we're talking about uh, the particular branch of training that they're involved in, which is leadership training. And the question that I've got for you today, Tanya, is what are the typical age ranges of your customers? Hi, Paul, for sure. Uh, so generally, we talk to leaders of corporations. So, well, it varies a little bit, probably 35, late 30s to mid 60s would be the average range in our rooms. Wow. And then for your dogs? <laughs> yeah, our dogs are a wide range of age and our leaders, too. Um, we have Lily, who is certainly one of our most famous leaders, and uh, this was Lily before she went to a race in 2011, and she was 10 years old, so, you know, in people years, that would be the equivalent of 70, wow. and uh, Lily was an incredible leader, um, incredible at training new leaders, she was hard-driven, passionate, um, my gosh, yeah, the drive in that dog was just, anybody would be blessed to have a leader like that in an organization. Wow. But then in contrast, you know, we had uh, in that race, Maverick, her grandson, uh, actually running and Maverick was only three, uh, so, you know, about the equivalent of 21 years in people, people ages. Wow. And part of the reason, I mean, Maverick is an amazing leader too, and, and he was a leader in training in that race. Um, and part of the reason Hank put him up with Lily is Lily is very hard personality to work with. Um, very serious, very intense. And uh, she intimidates a lot of the other younger leaders in the team just because she's so intense. Wow. Where her grandson Maverick here, he's he's a very laid back leader. So, um, you know, all leaders have so many different personalities and Maverick is, uh, you know, the quiet leader, just lead by example. So this was climbing the Eagle Summit in that race. And uh, Lily had been running in single lead, which is almost what she prefers. But uh, because the climb was so steep, Hank had put Maverick, her grandson, up beside her to help uh, help climb the mountain. Right. And we say Lily was such a great leader in training because, or a leader to train because as Hank put Maverick up and they got to the steepest part of that mountain, um, Maverick being a young leader was like, this isn't fun. What the heck are we doing this for? And he actually tried to turn the team, Maverick being the one on the right. Um, Maverick is the one yeah. here on the right where the point is. That's Maverick, exactly. Yep. And this and Lily, Lily, Lily here on the left. Mm -hmm. um, so Maverick tried to turn and take the team back down the mountain and uh, Lily, I mean, Maverick would have outweighed Lily by probably 10 pounds, uh, oh. you know, big, big, young, strong boy. Yeah. Um, but she held him straight and, you know, she like, rah, 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 at him, like, we are not going back down this mountain. We've just made this much progress. And he's like, okay, fine. So he put his head down and, you know, followed her example. And, and the team got to the top of that summit just a few minutes after that picture was taken. So oh. Um, I mean, and that's one of the things that we find this, this picture is the next race, the next year, the thousand mile of Diderod. Uh -huh. um, and that is the other amazing leader we had at the time, Strider on the right hand side. And uh, this is Strider that, here. That Strider. Yeah. And Strider was uh, 10 going on 11 in that picture. And then the dog right beside him with the one blue eye, one brown eye is Scully. Um, and Scully is another here. Lily granddaughter. Yep, that's Scully. She's Lily's granddaughter. Wow. And uh, she would have been four in that race. So quite often we'll team up our older leaders with our younger leaders because my gosh, they, they can train them so much faster than anything we could do. Wow. They just teach by example, lead by example. Lead by example. A fantastic yeah. way there to run things and to run life. Yeah, so that has been absolutely amazing. So thank you very, very much for that wonderful insight today on those uh, typical age ranges. Uh, so for further details there, if anyone is interested, you can reach out to Tanya uh, on this email address or you can visit them on their uh, website, which is winterdance.com. So thank you all very, very much. And we hope you all uh, liked our videos and you will have a wonderful day and come back soon. Thank you very much.